Last time on Wild Arms, the Demon General Alhazad had arrived at Court Seam to issue an ultimatum. Surrender the Rune Drive, or die. Fortunately, the town had an evacuation plan in the event of an emergency, and followed it while our hero stayed behind to fight the monsters. However, it appears the Demon Race was counting on the evacuation, and used the threat as a distraction to lure the villagers out into the open. What? Can our hero save the villagers before Alhazad gets to them? Find out in today's episode of Wild Arms. It's a boss battle. I should get some more experience than that. Primity Christmas, all right. There's nothing in here now. Right then. Oh, well, that's where that led. Wait, let's just go back the same way I came. I did, didn't I? <laughs> I did. Well, gives me time to save anyway. Come on, I just took on one of your big brothers. You really think you guys stand any remnants of a chance? Pissed off and ready for round two. Do that all you want. It's not gonna work on me. You... You're not who you appear to be, are you? Mr. Waxwell is in the other room guarding the treasures. I'm helping him by guarding this room against the monsters. Okay. Well, apparently that's the only way I can go is the way that I was going before. Okay. Oh, well, thank you. Not that I needed it. Realize I'm gonna kick your ass when I wake up, right? <laughs> Gotta say, I was a little bit ticked off about that, but. 
All right. So everyone, okay, everyone's awake. So it's just a in battle thing. We're fine. Let's go. Wait. So what the heck? For crying out loud. Yeah, I'm a little ticked off at your friend. You put us to sleep and you're gonna have something to deal with. I would really like to know where you got your, uh... Your magic from. Mr. Orc Lord. Alright. Think about this now. Hmm, think about this now. Where have I... Already gone. Curious. Then here. And there's that door. Okay. Everyone seems to be safe, but I don't trust the guy that's guarding that door. I really, really don't trust that guy. <coughs> Excuse me. What am I missing? I'm gonna tear your ass up. Don't like when they put me to sleep. Okay. At the very least, I'm gaining levels, so I'm not worried about that. Alright, so we go up through here. That's magic door. Someone's... This is where I fought the dog, right? Oh, these guys. One. One and a half. Two. Ah, I forgot what that does. Okay, I see. Knocks down my MP. Ooh, ooh. Rudy used to say you've been going up levels. Jack has not been. So... There was a monster in this room. I would think it would be guarding something. But it wasn't. Maybe go back and talk to... These guys? supposed to be harmless to humans. I don't know. No, no, no. I don't know. When we first went in, there was nothing there. Then all of a sudden, the monsters appeared. That's because not all of... not everyone is as they appears to be. Well, there's nobody through here. Fine.
Should have took out the Orc Lord first. Should have known better. All that, and you still died. How unfortunate. Okay, where have I not been? So I've been up through there and there. Okay, there we go. So, someone disabled the defense systems, monsters all over the place. Where have I not been yet? Is it one of the doors that has to have a duplicator and I don't have one? I'm supposed to leave. Hmm. Sound is glitching. Uh, sound is definitely glitching out right now, but... Okay, hang on. Let's leave and go back. It's glitching out. Oh! Okay, maybe it'll fix itself. Preemptive strike. Oh, nice. Why? Well, I appreciate that. Okay. Rudy, that one. Jack, that one. Cecilia. No. Let's rethink that. Uh, Rudy. That one. Jack, that one. Cecilia, that one. Still alive. Some people just don't know when to die. No. Ah, I have an idea. I have an idea. Where are the the kids with the nuns? Where were they at? Dang it. You missed me. OK, 
Okay, up through the door. Alright, hang tight. There we go. Okay, sound is much better now. So... Where is the little girl that was... Or the little kid that was scared of... Things? Was she in here? Now that's where I fought the dog. Up here, perhaps? Oh, yeah, you're the person I don't trust. Especially with all these monsters around. You guys have no chance! No chance! Ouch. Alright. Okay. Um... Where or oh where? Wow. This way. Is it that other way? Oh, come on, guys. I just want to kill your master. Is that too much to ask? You're still alive? Fine. Next round, you're dead. Bye bye now. Okay, this way. Yes. Sorry, Cade. Uh, I can't believe we got invaded. The monsters didn't look like they forced their way through. They must have figured out a way to get through the barrier. That reminds me. Something like this happened before. Yeah, town of St. Centaur. That's right. I remember. I got past security by hardly against my body. That means go through with a human. They used the same method as I did to get through. The defenses they used as I did to get through the defenses got in with humans. We just saw a dog turn into a monster. 
I don't want to think that Villager became a monster. How could a human turn into a monster? Smart kids, I'll tell you exactly how we do it. We use special seeds. These seeds were developed with magic. These seeds don't register to the barrier. Thus, they were able to pass through. After they are eaten, the seed will grow inside the body and take over at our command. How perfect can this get? We turned the entire town into a giant laboratory. We may be made of different materials, but we demons have the same body construction as humans. If you guys are living flesh, then we are living metal. No one can stop us. Well, enough talk. I'll have to ask for the rune drive now. I'll have my orders. Damn it. I knew that guy couldn't be trusted. Alright, you son of a... I was on my way to do something, if you don't mind. Ah, I should have taken down the Orc Lord first. I keep forgetting. I haven't even cut you yet, but I have now. Now, I was on my way to go have a word with the god. I'd like to have a word with you. Excuse me? All of them miss. Nope, everyone's dead. <laughs> Alright guys, it's time to suit up. You guys work too hard. If you just ignored me, you'd have gone about your business. I hate you miserable maggots who live by those pitiful beliefs. Your time has come to die. Prepare yourselves. <laughs> 